Hey everybody, Martin. It's always on Power Bodybuilding here. Today is heavy chest and bicep day. It's going to be awesome. So today I'm going to show a little video. We got a little supplement lineup, L-Arginine, vitamin C, glucosamine. We're going to show you all calcium, my pre-workout. And the shaker cup. Best thing ever. I already took most of my stuff. So anyways, got that. That's my lineup. That's the power stack lineup. I got that, all that stuff works awesome. Got close to me. Oh, I keep my joints safe, L-Arginine for my workout. I'm gonna be taking that soon, vitamin C, keep my immune system going, and helps with recovery, and fish oil. Oh, I keep the heart and mind going, calcium, magnesium. Uh, it is awesome, um, uh, mostly to protect my bones and joints and prevents bone loss which is very important as you get older uh keeps you strong uh keep your bone bones going uh better they are the more uh you can lift so that's awesome love it um gonna take my pre-workout soon and i'll large an eye and then get to the gym get a good workout and today's gonna be awesome bicep day and pump up these little guns right here look at that you gotta lift heavy if you want to be big that's my motto anyways yes like i said in previous videos the more you lift stronger your bones get or your stronger your muscles get and your tendons um like i said i don't vary my workouts it's always super heavy um usually the lightest i go is like 90 um on most stuff uh, especially for arms and uh oh even back sometimes uh chest um everything like that so i'm gonna really excited to chest day and and arm day i love it it's gonna be awesome it's gonna be intense as usual like i said you gotta be, pretend to be a pro if you're gonna like oh lift like one which is really true uh it's on my jay cutler shirt and uh it is true like i lift intense i lift like training for the olympia but i mean you don't get strong unless you don't um that is the key um and it is awesome love it um uh, chest day it's gonna be awesome super heavy top bench uh hopefully get uh, 540 as usual work down to about 180 usually the lowest i go for bench uh incline bench and um my top bench on the uh, rack too oh then i'm also gonna do that and then dumbbell start with dumbbells warm up with like 35 and then start with about 110 uh, it's pretty good for just getting the muscles pumped. Do about 100 for dumbbell flies and go down to 85 for those. That's my two warm up sets. Um, 110s for um, oh, my incline press and um, work down to 90. Start with 110, go to 90, then do flies. Like I said, start with uh, 100, go down to 85, and then do top bench. 540, work to 180, then do reverse bench. Start with 180. I uh, use that for my reverse and go back up um, on the Smith machine. Every time I go up a pin, just do the motion in reverse. It's really awesome. Really good workout. Pause for a second at the bottom. Go again so you got no momentum. It is awesome, awesome tactic. Then I go to the um, uh, the rack where I do, again, top bench to um, uh, usually 450, sometimes 5 if I'm really, really strong. Um, Oh, if everything goes right, and then also do an incline um, from there with uh, so over 270, go down to 180, and then I go do a decline bench, um, start at the top with uh, 450, again go down to 180, and then go do um, machine pr incline press and machine flat bench. I like the way it stacks, do that, start with the um, heaviest to go, which is 260, and for the incline, I think it's like 310. Or 305 um, work my way down again to about 100 pounds which is the lightest I go sometimes 50 if I want like a really good pump um, then I do flies I do uh, push-ups with the cable take the cable handles um, stretch out into push-up position I uh, use about 100 on each side work down to like um, if I start with 100 go down to like 70 for my second set if I do a second set by that time I'm usually pumped Oh, and go do the um, pec deck, do that. Um, start with over 300, go down to 100. And then that's it for chest. And then I start with heavy biceps. Gonna do a uh, warm up with easy bar curls. Uh, start with 90, go up to 450. And then I go do cable. Um, 
or no, sorry, do preacher after that. Start with uh, 110, go to 90 for my second set. Then I'll go do uh, cable curls with the bar, um, both stacks. Uh, start with 340, go down to 180, and then I do one arm curls with 130, uh, 140 on a good day. Uh, again, work down to 100 or 90 um, for that. And then I go do cable curls with the um, easy bar attachment. Do that. Start with 200, go down to... Again, go down to like um, 150, 100. Oh, then do, uh, uh, oh my God, I'm getting lost here. So much information, but yeah. So then I go to hammer curls. That's the word I'm looking for with a rope and dumbbells. Then I do my dumbbell or barbell hold with about six plates, go down to two. And then I start my forearm workout after that. I do behind the back wrist curls. I do wrist curls with the stack, uh, cable stack, uh, 200, go down to 100. And then get on a sit on a fl uh, bench, uh, arms over the bench, and do reverse uh, wrist curl, which is really awesome. Getting my forearms super pumped. And then I do twenty ones, uh, usually with a um, hundred pound barbell, and do that to finish my arms off. And then it's a little bit of abs, uh, rope crunches. Um, I sit on a bench and do like a like do a pullover, crunch my abs. It's awesome. And then I do side bends with the cables. Uh, Usually 170 a side, so that's pretty awesome. Do two, three sets, and then it's cardio. I use it for about 15 minutes, and I am done. I'm ready to eat, so I'm going to get my shit together and get ready to go and get some videos. So I hope everyone's watching, get inspired. Get your friends to subscribe. You subscribe. Thanks for watching. Keep liking my videos. Keep watching, and I will keep making them.